Hello and welcome to What Joe Wears, where I do unboxing videos and try-ons. And today I have a Wantable. So Wantable had a deal going, which they have periodically. But this one was, you pay the regular $20 styling fee. And then at the end of your order, they will add another $25 credit onto your um, order that you get for free. And then also, you guys have heard me talk about Ebates before. Ebates always has a thing where if you click on the link and you go to Wantable through that, you get $7.50 back. It's like a rebate, like an online rebate. So I'm gonna leave a link for that down below because um, I have left it before and I know some of you don't use it yet. But if you shop online, you can use it like almost everywhere and get money back. Even if it's like 50 cents at a time, like it's really helpful. I've gotten so much money back. All right, let's get into this box. All the boxes come with a prepaid envelope that you can just pop the stuff you want back in the mail for no charge, which is awesome. Let's read the styling note. This is from Haley and it says, Hi, Jill. The start of a new year is a time to invest in staple pieces that you can wear throughout the seasons. These pieces swap interchangeably with your current wardrobe and are just a refresh that your closet has been craving. It is a pleasure to style you as well as include some of the pieces that you requested from the stream, which you can go on their app or online and you can request things that you see that they have. The thing with Wantable is I think they are very limited on what they have. So the good news is that the turnaround time to get your box is super duper fast. I ordered this just a couple days ago and I've already gotten it. Um, the disappointing part is that they don't have a lot of stock. So some of the things are just, they are quality pieces. I will say that. I'm very happy when I keep things because they are really nice and they have all those deals so you can get money off, which is also nice. Okay. Um, I'm only including the Sienna Tomboy jeans for you to try because sometimes they will send you like three or four pairs of jeans out of your seven items. And I told them like, please just send me like one or two pairs as well as the crisscross threader earrings. Try pairing them with the gathered sleeve waffle top for a chic boho look. Add your favorite ankle booties and conquer your day in style. Let me know what you think. You're going to look amazing. Enjoy Haley. Cool. All right, let's see what we got. Ooh, I like all these colors. So this must be the earrings cute little pouch. I have kept a several of the pieces that I've gotten for jewelry from Wantable. However, I did just buy two new pairs of earrings from The Loft. Here's one of them. And these are kind of similar. I did used to have a pair of these that I got, I think, from Loft, and I think that they tarnished really easily. These are 14 karat gold filled. So hmm, we'll see. Next up, oh, this is really cute. It's like a chambre-ish and it has some faded red looking stripes through it. This is by One State. It has these nice ruffle sleeves. That would be great for now to wear with a cardigan or for later. I actually have a navy cardigan I think would look really great with this. Next is a shirt by Wantable. Oh, so I got, for my last Wantable box, I got a red and white stripe shirt that looked exactly like this. I did not keep it, but I did, I did really like it. It has some ribbing. All right, we'll see how that looks. All right, next is, it looks like a cardigan. This is by Fate. I wonder if it's reversible. Nope, I can see the stitching. 
has sort of a tribal looking print on the inside. I did just get rid of, I think like 10 or 20 cardigans because why do we keep buying cardigans? I had so many and so many tank tops. I was like, oh my gosh, like why do I need this much stuff? But yeah, it is nice and soft and I like it. So we'll see. Next, it looks like a waffle knit. Oh, this is by Z Supply. Ooh, this looks super short. And I don't know how that's gonna look on me. It's kind of wide. It's a pretty color. I really like the color. But yeah, I don't know. I'm very short torsoed, so ooh, I don't know how that's gonna look. All right, next is a shirt that is by oh, Z Supply again. This one looks a little bit longer. Has a cute crisscross front, which I just got a shirt in another box. I had that crisscross front and it was green, a little different green, but this is nice. It's kind of like a sweatshirt, so it'd be super cozy. It's very soft. All right, and then lastly, we got a pair of jeans. Ooh, these are by Level 99. I've never had a pair of Level 99 jeans before. They look like they're a boyfriend which I have been looking for. Oh, there's a tiny bit of distressing right there. I think you all know I've been looking for some boyfriend jeans or girlfriend jeans or tomboy jeans or whatever, but I have not been able to find the perfect ones. All right, let's try on. I have on the jeans and the cardigan, and I actually had this uh, t-shirt that I got from my last wantable box that I just left on. So I think I like the pants. I don't know if I love them, but I like them. I'll have to see what other shirts look like with them on. But I don't love this cardigan. I feel like it's just too long and I'm just unsure of this part. It's like high-low but reverse. So like front is lower than the back. Trying a little different positioning of the camera. So here is the sort of sea foamish green top. It's very wide. I think the sleeves are cute and I really like the color. And I guess if you tuck it a little in front, it definitely looks a little better than I was anticipating, but I still think it's too short for my short torsoedness. And here is the other green top. I don't, it's so soft, but I don't think I love how this is. It just feels odd to me. Here is that pretty reddish, it's kind of like a candy apple color. I love the color. It's kind of the color of my lipstick. So I think this color does look nice on me. I'm just wondering if we're over this like tie bottom yet. I guess you could, you know, tuck it up and hide it. Um, it looks like, let's see, yep, it is just like that, so you can't like unbutton or untie it and there's buttons down there. It's a nice length. I'm wondering if it's too big too. So I'm noticing a lot of shirts that I'm getting. I'm just wondering if I need to size down in general. They have like a lot of like bagginess under the armpit and I'm thinking that that means the top is too big. I'm just unsure. I really like the color though. 
And this is the top I really wanted to be the winner. And I'm, I like it. Like initially I thought, okay, that's super cute. But I don't know how these are going to fit under a cardigan. I brought my navy cardigan out to see. And then again, it's very big in the armpits. Um, I think it's pretty roomy. So I think I could size down. I definitely would not keep this size because the armpit holes are so big. It is very, very cute though. I love the pattern. It's very subtle, but So I don't think it looks too bulky. Like a long necklace that would look nice. That's pretty cute. So I guess I would have to see if I can size down in the shirt and depending on how much it is. What were your thoughts? I'm kind of, mm, mm, they're okay. Like they're very comfortable in soft clothes. I don't know if the fits were quite right for me. Let's go over pricing though. See ya. The Z Supply shirt, the gathered sleeve waffle top and fair aqua is $59. I just didn't think it was flattering on my shape. The Sienna Tomboy and Fatigue Wash that I have on by level 99 is they are $89, which I feel like is normal for level 99. I'm not sure how I feel about them. I'm gonna wear them around a little bit more, maybe try a few more things on with them and see what I think. They might be really good, like most capri pants for the summer. The flounce sleeve linen stripe tom top chambray by one state is $69. Oh. However, I do have that credit, so I have to think about that too. The rib tie front top in red bud is W by Wantable. This is 58. Would you size down in that one? Probably. The tribal print cardigan in gray by Fate is $68. The Soft Spun Knit Cross Front Top in Pacific Blue by Z Supply is $66. And the Criss Cross Threader Earrings in Gold were $38. And those are by Wantable as well. Merchandise total $447. You get $25 off, as I said at the beginning. And then if you buy all of it, you get another 20% discount. This is taken off all one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items. However, you only have to buy five to get the discount, but off the seven, it would be $89.40. And then I had a $20 styling fee. So my total would be $312.60 if I kept all of it. I will not be keeping all of it. I don't even know if I will be keeping one of it. Actually, I probably will be keeping one to get um, that money back. So help me choose what looked good you guys helped me with my last box i kept that beautiful floral shirt that was navy with the red flowers on it so i'm wondering if you can help me this time what should i keep what should i send back what should i resize oh these are so hard 
I do have more boxes coming too. So those will be here. I'm not even sure when, but they're kind of coming whenever they come. Um, Trendsend, Alley Tired, and uh, Basham are on their way soon. So we'll see what's in there. I will re I will leave my referral link below if you would like to get your own wantable box. I will also leave instructions on how you can save with Ebates. And I will see you guys next time.